hello and welcome to a new video in this video i will show you how to annotate your schematic uh, after you finish the schematic for the entire design and to do this we have a few possibilities for example, when you complete your schematic, all of your components will appear with uh, something similar with this C and question mark for this capacitor. And uh, you will have all of this type of missing annotation for all of your components. And if you want to annotate it's the simple way is to perform this annotation automatically because if not you must to go one component by one and to enter manually and it's not recommended for even for for the small design but when you have a bigger design is very complicated so to annotate all of these uh, parts from your schematic we will go to this tool tools annotation and here we have this uh, annotate schematic if we press this annotate schematic uh, quietly this will will perform an annotation without uh, see, seeing uh, anything only simply press and proceed and you wait a few seconds and now everything was annotated with a number but this is the quickest way but if you want to, to see how your schematic is annotated we should go to this annotate schematic and here we have a different order of processing so we can select up and then across and after that up or we can select down then across and after that down or you can select uh, across then up or across the then down I will let this one so here we have uh, all of our components that are available in our schematic and to to annotate all of them we can go to this uh, tab and we can check the order for example for each page for example this is are the number for the order of the pages and we have this first uh, page and for this we can select uh, to start to for example with 100 for the second page For the second page you can start with 200 and so on and if we put like this when you look for a component 
to wait our FDIC nator which starts with uh, 700 so we know exactly if this uh, the 7 page is the the correct one for our FDIC nator so after that we select accept this the changes and now we will execute And now when uh, we go back to our first page we will see now we have rev destinator only starting with 100 when you go to the second page we have uh, rev destinator which are starting with 200 the third page 300 the fourth page 400 and so on 500 600 and 700 if you want to reset all of the rev destinator you will go back to these tools annotation and reset uh, schematic designators and now all all of the rev destinator are coming back in the initial state with this question mark if uh, you want to to go in an advanced menu you can simply press ctrl and plus l or this tools annotation board they will annotate and one window will pop out and here uh, we have possibility to annotate only one page or if we want to, we can uh, annotate all of them so this is the the cover sheet the top sheet sorry and this is the first page and now if we want to annotate this and to see which are the options we can select here annotate options and the same like before for the first page we can select here starting with 100 for example simply press ok and only annotate And now all of our components were annotated with uh, this number starting with 100 according to our options from here across then down and here in, in this tab you have uh, both of them you have this filter options which contains the pages and on the right side you can simply live uh, see the components which will be annotated so I will close this one and I will go back to this annotation reset all of them no <coughs> now all of the components were annotated and 
Sometimes if you want to improve uh, how your schematic uh, looks and to add some uh, notes or some details on your design you can simply add uh, some uh, details I will add it here a uh, rectangle for this for example and now we cannot see anything but when I simply select this I will set here the transparent I will deselect this field I will change the border with another color if you want to become a medium one and we can simply add uh, some details here Also, you can select the type for the text and the color. And now you can simply put here the description. This way we can improve a little bit how our schematic will look. We can put also this text inside of this rectangle. And we can simply adjust them. You can and here some notes with this text notes other people to know know what this uh, soda jumper represents another possibility to improve uh, your schematic is to go to this set uh, net colors and for example if we, we want to select for example 
for example for this default a color we can simply go here if you want to put a uh, color for the ground we can simply select all the grounds And now our schematic uh, looks a little bit better than before and we can bring a lot of improvements to our schematic. To find the component, for example, we want to look inside of schematic for this U204, we have to pursue possibilities right click and find text and now we identify two parts because one is the part itself and the other one is the designator of this part or we can simply press J from your keyboard and C for the component and here also we can type one U204 and your view will directly jump to that component example we are here GC 200 and now we have our components in this view mode I hope with this information with annotation was uh, useful for you and I also hope we will uh, see you see in the next videos. Bye-bye.